Oh, hi, everybody. This is your stay at home grandma. And I forgot to put my teeth in again. Forgive me. I'm doing your Friday cooking. Um, working up to make some dollar store um, recipes. So I got, let me just show you what I got. I gotta get up. Right back. I'm cooking on the back of the stove right now with some pork Okay, so I got, I've been getting, I got jasmine rice cooking. And I got that from the dollar store. That is some good jasmine rice. The only other one is the Chinese. There's a Chinese brand. I can't think of the name of it right now. Anyway, I'm just experimenting with some things. So I got these pork loin chops, the bone in, and it's stampede. And it is pork, pork loin chop. It contains 18% water and seasoning. Um... And it keep frozen, okay, and it was best by February 19, 2022. Okay, so, and this is, this is it. I got two of these, because it's just me and my husband today. And then I got, I'm making a two-pot deal, because the jasmine rice was cooking in the pot behind there. And I'm making this. As soon as, this is the stream, it's steam in the bag. I'm not going to steam in the bag. It is J.T. Farms. Santa Fe blend, corn, beans, red peppers, green peppers, and diced onions. So, and this excellent um, source of fiber. So, I'm putting that in in a minute. So, look, I'm going to cut it up. I'll be right back, and I'm going to cut it up and be talking to you, and I hope you can hear me. Oh, I paid so much for teeth. Waited so long to have them, and then forget to put them in. When I'm going out, I'm fine. So hey, okay. So in the the pork chop, I put some Cajun choice Creole salt seasoning. I put a little bit of um, blazing crushed red peppers. I put some garlic salt. Some onion powder, and lowery seasoning salt. So I'm going to turn these over and begin to cut them. Well, it cuts really good. I turned the fire I turned the fire off for a minute so I could cut it. But I'm gonna leave the bone in.
so I'm going to have to slide it back on. Turn it down, and then I'm going to put this in and give this some more seasoning. Turn that down just a little bit. Take my rice and go. Yep. Put the seasoning in it. I'm going to put this down. Put this down. And then I'll season it. So my rice is done. I'll show you my rice. And this is how it cooks. And it's really good. It's tasty. I've fallen in love with it. Because my favorite rice besides the white rice is the basmati rice and the jasmine rice. And of course, the, yeah, I like Uncle Ben's rice, but I have used... I, Use the dollar store rice. I bought it just to see what it would do with it. It cooked up fine because I'm, hey, my last name is Gonzalez. Should I tell you more? But um, I found that it was good rice. But I like Uncle Ben's rice still, but hey, you know. So we'll wait a few minutes. So every Friday, I hope to bring you something I'm going to cook. Might not always be from the dollar store might be from something else. But if you want me to cook something special or you want to find out a certain recipe, just hit me up in the, in the, on my Facebook page or here in the, in the room, you know, in the description box, you know, that when you leave a message or something like that, leave me a message and um, I will get back to you. So I'm also going to be giving you some summer drinks, things like that, that you can do that will just completely brighten up your day, whether you've got a whole bunch of family or yourself. You need to treat yourself. I found that family, a lot of family around is nice and cooking for them, but it also cooking for me and me and my husband. But when he's away, I still cook something. Making a hot dog can be satisfying and healing. Cooking is part of the healing process that people don't understand. And lots of people say, well, I don't cook because I don't like it. I have a couple of friends that cook because they have to. You know, they don't really like it, you know. But I have a couple of friends that like to eat out because they like food. So, okay, let me go wash my hands because I put my hands in my hair.
That was done. Let me go look at the, the meal. Put just a little bit of water in it so it won't stick. I'm going to stir it some more. Just enough seasoning. So we'll wait a few more minutes. It'll be done and then I'll show you it. I'm not going to plate it because it's still early yet. And he doesn't eat until 7 o'clock. I eat earlier, but I'll show you what everything looks like.
Now, if I had had rice already cooked, I would have made it just a one-part meal, but that's how it goes. So anyway, um, I want to teach, teach about the fruit teas that I make and just different things that I know how to do that I'm sure you know how to do, but if you don't know how to do it, get a pen and a piece of paper because it's real simple and just do it. I want to make some ice cream because I got a new ice cream maker. I got a new toy. I have a bread maker too. Um, well, I, I don't do bread very often, but you know, for the holidays and stuff like that, I used to make bread all the time. But you know, like I, again, it's only him and I, and you know, I just don't make bread. But you know, I will make bread for the holidays if God needs me to be here and all of that. So I'm gonna go back and check it again. We didn't get to see them. And I'll also take a picture of it. So if you like this, quick, easy meals. That's what I'm going to do. And quick, easy drinks and quick, easy dessert. And I'm not into desserts like I used to be, but I can be. Just tell me what you want to see. All right. If you like this, like, share, and subscribe. Leave a comment in the comment section. And I will talk to you all later. I love you. Take care. God bless. Bye-bye. Still stay safe. I'll see you in the next video. Adios!